Hey, good morning, everyone. This is Gibran here from Realco Capital. Hope everyone's doing well. Uh, today, I'm going to give you a brief on the Valley Master Development by Amar. Uh, and in fact, they're about to launch a third phase. Clients are already submitting expressions of interest. And what they're launching is affordable three and four bedroom townhouses with prices starting for around 1.45 million. And this is what Talia, which is a third phase in the Valley, looks like. They're townhouses which connect to what's called a golden beach. So it's one of the most prime clusters in the entire development. So uh, before I get started, I just want to request that you know if you like the content we're putting out please do consider liking this video subscribing to our channel in fact if you click our channel link you'll see we regularly post uh, you know detailed videos on this market we do deep dives into major hotspots and offline developments and we also cover macro trends uh, so please do subscribe to our channel it really does help us so if you're looking at the master plan of uh, the valley this was launched in 2019 and as you can see Amar has actually put out the entire master plan for in advance so you can see that in the future this is where Amar will be launching a lot of townhouses regularly probably every four to six months uh you know over the next three to four years so this is this is a, a major development of the buy and so within Thalia, you can see there's three different styles. Internally, they're going to be quite similar. Uh, and Eden was the first phase launched. That was 2019. Nara was second phase, which was launched in August, uh, September of last year. And then Thalia, the sales are going to start imminently. So if you are potentially interested, please do get in touch with us and we'll guide you through the process. And so if we look at the master plan, you'll see that, uh, you know, there's lots of different facilities that connect across the community. And uh, this is a snapshot of it. So we've got a sports village, which is sizable, 20,000 square meters we've got kidsdale right so it's different things for children to do uh the pavilion and the golden beach so the golden beach is going to be one of the most popular attractions for sure and talia the third phase connects directly to it so talia is going to have one of the most prime uh, locations in the entire master development. If we're looking at location plan, Valley is definitely located in the outskirts of the city. Uh, nearby developments include the Mock Hills 2, which is right next door, Villanova, which is you know now starting to hand over, Ranches 3, that's also MR, and of course, Original Ranches, which is blue chip and you know old money. And uh, this is a map of uh, existing townhouse developments in Dubai. And so as we can see, you know, majority of townhouses of the Bay and Villas is located in this core of the city, this belt here. Uh, and as you can see, the areas near the business districts, Dera, Sharjah uh, and Burda Bay, it's kind of underserved, right? There's not much affordable townhouse supply over here. So the Valley is definitely adding a lot needed supply into this area uh, moving forward. And if you're looking at the Mark Hills too, which is again next door to the Valley, this is started handing over in 2020 uh, and handovers are continuing their is about 800 families that have moved here and a lot of the people that are moving to the Mark Hills too are from Sharjah and from Nahada, Dera and Bur Dubai. Uh, the reason for that is it's affordable. If you live in Sharjah and work in Dubai, you want to get out, stop wasting one hour and a half, two hours of your life on travel commute times. Uh, and of course, it's much more affordable to just live in the Mark Hills and then connect to the rest of the city. So this is where the feasibility of the Mark Hills too gets very strong and Valley will also attract a very similar kind of clientele for both buying and renting in the future if you're looking at uh, the valley's location it connects to the city with through our land road so our land road is basically uh, one of the major arteries of the bay but since 2019 the rta are starting to extend it so it's going from three lanes to six lanes and they've already started uh, executing on that right so eight kilometers already been done they've built a new interchange and so this will continue to be expanded upon so it's a major project and uh, currently if you're going to be traveling from the valley to downtown it's about 25 minutes so that's fairly reasonable but you're also connecting to Sharjah, uh, Makhtoum Road, Expo Road so this it, it it has its own feasibility so just because it's in the outskirts of the city doesn't mean it's supposed to be written off right every single development in Dubai has its has its different feasibilities and I think it's important to kind of dive deep and understand that and so if we're looking at Talia these are some internal renders and uh, I want to talk about prices. So three bedroom townhouses, 1.45 to 1.7 million. Uh, and four bedroom townhouses, 1.8 to 2.1 million. The higher end of that range is going to be properties that are located very close to that golden uh, golden beach. Uh, payment plan is 60% payable during construction, 40% on handover. So I want to talk about the uptrend. If you bought in quarter four 2019, I, I remember I sold a few properties here at, back in the day. And look at the, the, the way the prices have risen between that time. This is, of course, a different market. Prices now are reflecting current market demand 
uh, current market realities. Back in the 2019, 1.15 to 1.25 million for three bedroom townhouses, four bedroom townhouses, 1.55 to 1.65 million. Also, anytime an investor is buying the first phase of a development, they're rewarded because subsequently the prices are revised upwards or payment terms are less attractive. So payment plan for the first phase was 70% payable during construction and then 30% payable over 30 months post handover. This is the master plan of Talia. As you can see, there's one row which is on the Golden Beach. This will be the first to go. It'll also be the most expensive. That's very unique. None of the houses are are back to back. Everything is single row. There's a few green belts in place, as well as a swimming pool and, and gym facilities, which is pretty standard. Uh, and uh, the other thing I want to leave you with here is, uh, you know, the competing development next door, which is the Mock Hill. So in case you're looking to buy a townhouse in this area, which is affordable townhouse in Dubai, um, you know, you can also consider the Mock Hills too, right? And in the Mock Hills too, they are ready options and off-plan options. In fact, some of the off-plan options will be handed over over the next, you know, six months to the next year. And uh, depending on what you buy over there, a three-bedroom townhouse can cost you between 1.1 to 1.9 million, <coughs> depending on the size. A four-bedroom townhouse can cost you between 1.7 to 1.95 million. Again, there's different size ranges, it's different payment plans, so lots to consider here. Uh, in terms of value, I also think that you know if you're a townhouse buyer, another thing to consider is obviously the Mark Lagoons project. It's got a much more prime location, so that's something that you should also keep on your radar. Uh, we've I've made a couple of very good videos on the Mark Lagoon, so I'm going to leave a link of that here in the description box. So the value, basically, you're looking at these kind of price points. When you're buying an MR project, you are slightly paying a premium at times but let me tell you something the mock mr is as everyone knows mr is blue chip and so you know if you want something which holds its value rises faster than the market average uh mr is the best and biggest brand to to invest with and uh you know if especially if you're a first time buyer there's no better place to park your money than with mr and uh yeah so that's a basic brief on the valley project uh we have a lot more information to share with you in case you're interested in this development so if you're if if you'd like to get in touch with us our number is here on the screen you can feel free to give us a call send us a whatsapp send me an email and we would uh, we would love to hear from you so thank you very much for watching this video please do like this uh, video if, uh, if you found it useful and do subscribe to our channel thank you very much